it morning guys we're going down to feed the horses yeah. we are running away from Sophia pretend we're dr <laughs> you are mean <laughs> poor Sophie we're getting ready to go to the barn good at morning guys I would have actually left the road like, <laughs> so would I have Good morning, we're getting ready to go to the barn, take advantage of this gorgeous weather. And Sophie came out of the house last, and Sam was driving, driving up the driveway. Mm -hmm. We were gonna forget <laughs> you, but Dad forgot you. It's fine, but it needs a break anyways. Before we can go anywhere though, we have to go down and feed our horses lunch. Because that's what horse owners do. You feed, 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 right, and go feed. feed. Go feed, girls. Look at all the hay out there. So much hay. A little bit of hay. But they don't really eat it. Like, they're really picky. You forgot to honk the horn. When she comes back, you gotta honk the horn. <laughs> She's gonna be so mad. We're the worst parents. Yeah. <laughs> Sophie said, yeah. Don't you want to see your sister jump? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're just terrible. Guys, you gotta have fun sometimes. You just gotta have harmless fun. When people, yeah, when people honk the horn and I walk in front of the car, I get so annoyed. Like, it makes me so mad. Oh, look, they hear Gabby's in there. Penny's like, I'm coming, Laura. <laughs> she doesn't even know if it's me. No, that's the thing. Everybody has their own different opinion of how much food to hit, to send, to throw. Seems like they still have tons of breakfast. Just throw a little hay. Gabby comes out with the biggest pile ever. Pew! Enough hay for the whole day for lunch. But our horse, like Penny, is not chubby. All right. So we don't want to scare the horses. So Sam's gonna back up a little tiny bit. I have to put hide the camera too. just kicked Gracie but she's so gentle she's such a gentle horse like she lifts her leg up a little well, tiny you bit scared me successfully we scared you, you successfully jump. you didn't jump <laughs> it's really nice here because with the whole COVID stuff happening we can kind of be private at the barn if we come when nobody else is here which is what we've been doing mostly trying to do is come when it's when nobody else is here and I really like this barn because they have this spray outside every stall and you just spray everything you touch before you leave. I swear it's why we haven't been sick yet. Hi Gino. Hello. He's like, oh, again. <laughs> again. Let's look at your abscess. I don't know if you can see. I can't get it down there. His abscess was literally a tiny pinprick. So Gabby, who are you riding first? Yeah, so when we when we ride and our coach is in here, um, Gabby's going to flat Finn today and flat Chino today because she's bringing along Chino, two horses right. and Sophie's going to get Finn and then we are going to get our ride on. But for anybody who's confused, how we ride is we ride our horses three times a week. We ride two lessons and then we want ride one other ride. Sometimes we work ride four times a week, but usually just three and a little bit more when we're getting ready for a show and Basically, we flat when we're alone and we flat for the majority of our lessons and then I do a few minutes of jumping at the end under the direction of our instructor. And sometimes we do a tiny bit of low level jumping when we're by ourselves. That's them. Oh, you can't see. Can't see Chino because he's standing in the light. That's the two boys. Gabby's two show boys. And Sophie's one show boy. Don't smell the poo, Finn. So it's time. Unfortunately, it's time. What are you doing, Gabby? Cutting his 
She's cutting his mane. Why are you cutting his mane, Gabby? Because it grew out. It grew out. Why do you need to cut his mane? Because it's too long. Because it's too long. But what did we cut it for? It looks bad. <laughs> but we cut it for a reason. This part didn't really grow because the blanket cut it off. Yeah, that's okay. So Gabby's cutting his hair for show season. How short do I cut it? That Just cut it a little bit and then cut it a little bit more if you don't like it. To cut it that short though. All right. So Gabby has a theory about hair cutting. What is it, Gabby? I'm better than Brandon at it, but I still suck. He, she's better at Brandon, but she still sucks. And we know that a lot of people believe you should pull instead of cut. And then there's some people who say, yeah, it's fine to cut. And we and just, just put it off. I just cut it so off. So we, lots of times, we cut until it gets to like an appropriate length and then she pulls. So it's not just sitting there uneven. Yeah, didn't stand on my face. But we also believe that it's just hair. And we also believe that you don't really see it anyways because it's show season. His br hair is braided. Yeah, like when the braider gets a hold of this boy this year, like we had such a good braider. When the braider gets a hold of him, his hair will be really short. Like it was almost standing straight up. That's how short she had to do it to make his braids good. I wish I could braid. Gabby, does it make you nervous with all these people watching you? A little bit. A little bit. All right. How it's gonna turn out so we warned you guys how it's gonna turn out so we're gonna come back and we're gonna see it when it's all done some people actually do get really bent out of shape over hair and it just grows like it literally just grows and when you're at a show it's braided and if your hair can't look bad when you're just home hanging with your homies then the world is just too harsh what's happening in here we're just chilling. <laughs> You're just chilling too? Finn! So Sophie had a chance to ride Finn today, but she rode him yesterday, and we like to give them a break after they have a ride. And this boy has stamina for days, but she still likes to give him a rest. <laughs> so the, the snow is falling. Yeah. The snow is falling off the roof, which is not that big of a deal, but when our horses spook, they don't run away. They try and run behind us. Like, they're like, Save me! I don't think that's normal. <laughs> I think you're supposed to run with your herd and but you know what you guys maybe he thinks we're his herd and we'll save him. Also no other horses in here. <laughs> also no other horses in here. You're okay Finny Finn. Okay, but at least it's not all in a straight line. Straight lines is like bolt cuts for horses. Yeah. Oh that looks great Gabby. Oh so she says it looks really choppy but it's not in a straight line. You think it's short enough? No, because we gotta cut it up to there. But yeah. I'm not doing that. Why? Because. Who? Somebody's gonna have to do it. I know. That's always the braider. Yeah. Every year we get better at braids. Yeah. I think Chino's loving this. He's like, yes. Rub my neck. Scratch me. I like it. I think it looks good. Yeah. yeah it's hard to see in here. The sun is like in my the eyes. The sun is in our eyes. You look handsome, Chino. Okay, that's it. That's it. That's well, it. I can do this. Just to make it well, look a tiny bit I mean, I thought you wanted it shorter. I kind of do, but like, I suck at it. So. Well, anyways, it's winter, so I mean, if he has long hair for a little bit longer, it's not going to hurt anybody. <laughs> the snow just slid off the roof again, and Gabby said, mm, that's going to be fun. Slowest person in the world. We should have been here at 10 a.m. His hair looks gorgeous, I think. Okay. Looks so cute. He likes it. It looks nicer in real life. You're getting to be good, Gabby. And just like that, my little friend came. <laughs> I used to stay up all night, trying to find my place. Chasing me on lights and looking for some kind of trace. To lead me out of darkness, give me a little faith. Something to make me stronger, someone who could like the way. And you came to me and you gave me reason uh, mm, mm, mm. I almost can't believe it Every time we touch I feel at home There's no way I'd ever let you go When you put your hands in mine I know I'm gonna be alright I don't know what you do to me but I feel like I am waking up in the sky 
what you like the best like is it and and comment why you like vote a chino and b grayfin and tell me what you like about your choice is it the pretty way that grayfin does poles or is it chino's beautiful hunter movement and it has gabby riding in his saddle because it's got bigger knee rolls and he finds that she's unable to pinch her knees as, as much she also is riding with a little bit longer stirrup but for whatever reason, she's gotten into the habit of pinching with her knees. Pinching with her knees and throwing her the right side of her body forward. Everybody like everybody has bad habits. Some people look down at the jump as they're going over. Some people pinch with their knees. Some people uh, don't keep their thumbs up. Some people lean too far back. Some people lean too far forward. What are your specific bad habits? It's whenever we recognize that our bad habits are that we're able to fix them and figure them out and change them. Don't forget, comment down below. Who do you choose? A, Chino, B, Finn. Every time we touch, I feel at home. Just the way I never let you go. So being back to having two horses means more work again. More work for me. <laughs> I'm going to take Chino back so he can be with Finn because I actually hear Finn out there screaming. I always feel like that's how horses get hurt. Oh. <laughs> Chino's like, let me smell your bum. <laughs> it's a kitty. All right, let's go Chino Bambino. I don't like horses running around like crazy in the field because that's how injuries happen. And I can hear, I could hear Finn from inside the barn. Oh, maybe it wasn't Finn. Finn's just standing at the hay bale. <laughs> Quiet and calm as can be, but he's looking this way. Chino's like, yay, I was ridden. Chino seems happy to be in work. And I'm happy because I love the way Chino moves. I think Chino is our prettiest horse. Our prettiest moving horse who's moving behind me right now. You worried about him, Finn? Hey, were you calling him? Don't you know that you're beautiful? 